hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Yep. I'm gonna need you. <laughs> Woo hoo hoo. Oh man, 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 man. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Man, man, man. The clip is drawn every day. There's some sh going on. Ah, this L is working overtime, bro. I never thought that battle rap, like, we'll be at this point right now. Like, battle rap is in a real lull right now. Uh, you, a lull. You know what I'm saying? Not a low, but a lull. Like, it's in a drag mode. It's not a lot. It's some good things going on, but it's a lot of nasty work. And I'm talking about, this is crazy because we get so many of these, and I know you've probably heard other bloggers say that we get so many people that send clips and send you this, and you don't even have to solicit. You don't have to ask people to send you nothing. But... I got a clip yesterday of a battle rapper mm -hmm. taking a whole T-Rex verse, like the, the whole no verse for you. You My shooters, relentless. Fuck around and get your baby mama hit. That's you should be proud of me. She died comfy in her pajama fit. Took the food stamps and the work. Put the stamp on the pack for inflation. These Joe Biden bricks. Okay, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Molly goes for 19. That's with no cut. Your man got it for 15. So what? Right. Mine's all rocks and his looks broke up. You a gangster? But online, you so tough. I got packs to move. The Molly's going for 19. Fast with no cut. Your man's got it for 15. So what? Mine's is rocked up. Yours is broke up. Let me keep. And got it for fifteen. So what? Right. Mine's all rocks and his looks broke up. Your pops tough, but his son a fag. Gold dust. So broke up. Let me keep this pole up. Man, it's fat. Let me keep this pole tough. Just in case I got the rest when drag this fat. He gold dust. Use a comedian. A nigga got killed over a tweet just last week. Better have fast feet. Real killers keep all types of heat under the driver's seat. It was what kind of shit is here? <laughs> like back in the days, the freestyle joints that he was doing with Calico, the gladiators. I couldn't believe it. I was, I was shocked. Hey yo, what the fuck? I'm not gonna lie. And I and I've been in battle rap and been doing this for a long enough time that not a not a lot of things shock me. But when I seen this clip of a dude, it was the Murder Mook, Rex, Daylight, the Gladiator School freestyle joint. And I rem you re these are the joints from like this is part of history here. It's not like first of all, we're gonna start with the premise of taking someone's bars word for word, line for line is horrible anyway. We've seen instances of this before. Uh, you know, people called out other MCs and when Surf had the, 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 the fucking Quilly Mill shit, even it wasn't word for word line. It was a whole controversy like battle rap people are very, 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 very prideful about the writing of the material, the lyrics. You know, I just did a video yesterday with Snake using the same rounds in different battles. Like, it's a competitive sport. It's a competitive nature. Like, if you don't want to compete at the highest level or be the best, don't be in this. You could come to the side, shoot some blogs. You know what I'm saying? Like, aspire to do something different, but do not jump in the ring and disrespect this sport. Because at the end of the day, you're battling against somebody. Let's say there's money involved. Let's say there's opportunities involved. And you could take an opportunity from someone by winning a battle, but using somebody else's material. Like, bro, you can't, what, what? So, uh, you know, he, he takes the bars. <laughs> He got away with it, but he ain't get away with it. You know what I'm saying? He basically takes them and he remixed a little bit to try to make it a little new. You know what I'm saying? And if you look at um, Lou Kane versus Johnny Gats, it's a battle on RBE. Salute to Rare Breed Entertainment. I salute to ARP, Lawrence Shata, Wing, uh, my man EJ. Everybody over there, all the artists and everything on RBE. 
This is not an RBE thing. Salute to the bricks. Everybody that's doing their thing. And the Coach Cole Jones, you know, the cautions. All, all of y'all. I can't remember everybody right now. Shit. I can't. You know what I mean? Um, but they working hard over there. Them motherfuckers are working hard. Pain. You know what I'm saying? Like, if, as y'all come up in my mind, I'll keep remembering. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But, uh, you know, um, Remedy Loco. All of that. These niggas is working hard. Like, busting their ass to really, like, put on good performances. And... When you get your performance robbed by somebody taking somebody's bars, because now it's not even about the battle no more. And then, y'all want to know what made this shit worse? Oh my god. I... <laughs> so not only does my man take Rex verse, right? So uh, my man C-Dot, who he's battling, C-Dot, South Carolina, is battling him next. He sent me the clip, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure he don't give a fuck. He sent it to me. So I looked at it, I said, what the fuck? So when I see how much of this man verse he took, I said, oh, no, nah, he going up on the Summer Jam screen. And mind you, this happened a couple months ago. But it was, like, low, you know what I'm saying? Like, nobody really, like, it wasn't, it didn't get into nobody's hands that got that kind of wham, you know what I'm saying? I got that kind of wham. This is Summer Jam screen. I could put you up on the screen. I could get you out there. I, this video of me talking about it is going to do more views than the actual battle. I got that kind of wham. Top three, top three. Let's, let's stay consistent. Um, so... And that's just, it is what it is. But, yeah, you took the man whole verse. You got away with it. But you ain't get away with it. Like, bro, did you think nobody was not going to know? Me and Rex are not the best of friends. I have no relationship with Rex. I don't have no vitriol or hate towards Rex. I mean, he might not like the things that I've said about his battle rap career. But I remember Rex from when he was a legend. Them shotgun shells is red and lime green. So when I'm squeezed, it's a Gucci crime scene. No, I said them shotgun. I remember them. The murderer, you know what I'm saying? So I, I maybe I'm wrong for wanting you to be what I thought you could be. You know what I'm saying? So I may, that might that might be the reason me and Rex don't get along, or you know what I'm saying? He'll get an interview, he'll be like, "Fuck, Vada, I'm cool with that." You know what I'm saying? Get my flex on, keep the text drawn. I don't even hate on those who hate me. I got Rex on. Like I don't even mind. That was I'm nice like that. I swear, but. I, I don't even mind. Like he, he said, ask me an interview. So what? I got enough respect that if you disrespect a legend like that, I got to talk about it. That's just how I am. Cause I don't have no beef with these rapping niggas. I don't know these niggas. I don't. We don't run in the same circles. I don't see these niggas. We don't shop at the same supermarkets. So when a battle rapper be mad at me, it's 99% gonna be because of something they did in a rap battle. You will never, ever, ever, ever see. Like, nowadays or with my life, with me going back and forth with a battle rapper, that's something about, not about battle rap. See, that's the thing. I can keep it about the bars, the battles, you not doing good, you losing, or you recycling, you choke. See, they, they don't mind doing it. They don't mind doing it. They mind hearing about it. They mind, you know what I'm saying, niggas knowing the bullshit. They don't mind doing it. Do, they, they will do this shit to y'all fans forever, but they don't care. But once they know a nigga's gonna call them out on it and not give a fuck about it, they don't like that shit. And I'm glad they don't, and I'm gonna keep on fucking doing it. So anyway, uh, Rex a whole legend, my man. What's your name? Lou Gats? Johnny Gats? He a whole legend. I only said your name once in here because it's not about your name, it's about the activity. I'm not here to pump you up and make you famous, you know what I'm saying? Like, you go, you going on the Summer Jam stream for taking his verse, but I'm not here to pump up your name and make it, so you might get a lot of third person. So my man is what I'm going to say. My man takes his verse, uses it, even put a little Joe Biden. And then the worst part about this is, because you asked me to watch the battle, and I watched it. The worst part about this is you could actually rap. Because I watched it. I said, you know what? If you talking like this, I'm going to tell you what you said. You told me when I posted this because you knew you was going up. Yeah, this the big show. You knew you was going up over here. I got 40,000 on Twitter and I got 80,000. I got, I got a lot here. So you knew you was going up. He says, you must go and name every rapper that did this. Should have did, did this when it dropped six months ago. Thanks, though. Did you listen to the entire battle or just a round? Saying that I must be going to put up a video for every single battle rapper who has done this before, and I should have did it six months ago when this came out. Nigga, I didn't know who you was six months ago. I don't know who you are now. You know what I'm saying? So what makes you think I should have did this six months ago? So you're not taking the best, uh, the best ability is accountability. This nigga's not taking no accountability for doing this shit. And he is going to be mad at me for talking about it. 
Oh, nigga, nah, nah, you gotta be fucked. Come on, B. Get, yo, yo, stop playing with me, fam. Yo, stop, stop playing with me. We, in, I, I got a problem with you even thinking that you could play with me like that. Don't, don't play with me like that, bro. What? You not taking no accountability at all? None. The nigga is saying like, yo, basically, uh, you must go do this to every what? <laughs> so I said. This is my reply. I said, you took T-Rex, a battle rap legend, whole verse, used it like it was yours, and want me to watch the entire battle, then want me to worry about other people who did the Bush League bullshit that you did, your man got it for 15, so what? Nick, you want, like, I, bro, I can't do that. Like, I can't. You can't do that type of stuff, man. You gotta, you gotta move a little smarter than that, because seriously, like, a lot of people, this is the first time they gonna see you. You know what I'm saying? Like, Verve replied to my shit. Easy reply. A lot of MCs are seeing this. You think my phone ain't been lit up? Like, bro, you got to call them out. Ike P, Sway, Restore Order. Yeah, y'all got to jump on that. Everybody got, yo, he got to go. He got to go. Angry fans, uh, unbiases, Piper, everybody. He got to go. You can't do that. Like, you, you're not allowed to just come in here and take a nigga whole verse and just, it is what it is. No, no, we all do dumb shit in life, man, but nigga, it's 2023, bro. Like, it's a new year and anything. You started the year off like this? And then, like I said, the worst part about it is you can actually rap. You asked me to watch it, I did. So now, you know what I'm saying, I did the prerequisite. You asked me, did I watch it? I watched the battle, bro. But you can't be up here ruining people's platforms doing stuff like this, fam. You cannot, like, nah, it's unacceptable. Unacceptable. A whole legend? And mind you, it's a legend that me and him don't even have no relationship. Nigga said, F me. And I'm still up here like, nah, it can't happen like that. Not to him. It just won't go down like that. I'll be here fighting for his, I'll be here fighting for his, uh, for his legacy. But I'm going to leave it at that. Y'all stay up, man. <laughs> this was nasty work. The nastiest of the nasty work. Gang. He got away with it. But he ain't get away with it.